Alright, time to get this video started because I feel like this shit is gonna collapse on me. Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Sonali. Welcome to a new video. If you guys are not already subscribed, definitely go ahead and do so. And if you are already subscribed, make sure your post notifications are turned on. All right, today we are doing a massive unboxing. I placed a freaking crazy order on Amazon just because there was like stuff I've been wanting for a while and then there's some like fall things. And also I have an Abercrombie package. I have a PR package. I'm not sure what's in here. So we're gonna find out together. So I thought I would just vlog it for you guys. Kind of have like a chill talk through video and open some packages. So let's get started with this box just because I literally don't know what's in here. I'm filming this when the sun is like at its brightest, which is probably not the smartest decision, but gotta do what you gotta do. I don't know how, but Dolce Vita got my email and they sent me two pairs of shoes, like I think last month, and then they were like, oh, let us know if you want anything else. I was like, literally this is a dream. Um, and so I got these cute shoes this time. I love a good mule and they're nude mules and the um block is kind of like this wood like pale wood color i think they're so adorable especially for the fall i find myself not wearing as much black anymore so i thought i would just get like a nude a nude like comfy heel we got back home from the beach yesterday and we came back to perfect weather it's finally fall here in austin so i can finally start styling some fall outfits i think i'm currently banned on tiktok which sucks because when i got back home i was like so excited to film some content and, like reels and tiktoks and everything but it just like makes me feel like i shouldn't even film them because i think i'm banned like it's so weird okay all right what is this oh Okay, so I honestly think my Amazon glitched because there are three things in these boxes that I ordered doubles of and I don't think I actually ordered doubles. I could totally see it being like I ordered two of one thing, but I literally do not think I ordered double of three things. So that's kind of sketchy, but I'm going to just return them. Thank God Amazon has free returns. Um, but this is a part of my Halloween costume actually. I'm gonna go as a Bratz doll. And so I got this like glitter choker and it actually came with a bracelet as well. Next up is something that I've actually had on my to-do list for so long is ordering um, lens protectors. The last time I got one of my lenses serviced, the guy was like, you should have like lens protectors on all of your cameras. And I was like, what the hell is that? <laughs> like, I've never heard of it. I've heard of ND filters, which is kind of like, you can adjust the exposure even more kind of thing. Like you can make it darker even though like the camera won't go darker, but these are kind of just for protection. And honestly, I need that because I'm not the best with um, my you know, technology. So I'm gonna put this on my vlogging camera and I'm gonna buy two more for um, my most used lenses. I'm guessing these are shoes. Another part of my Halloween costume furry shoes <laughs> why are these actually so cute what the hell and they were like i want to say like 23 bucks it's not bad at all they're like furry they have like that glitter to match the um choker this is a heavy one if you watched my vlogs at the beach you guys would know that i'm planning my 25th birthday party i have so many things on my amazon list that i want for my birthday just like disposable cups and um table runners and all that stuff i'm gonna wait a little closer to my birthday or just like wait till the first week of november to start ordering stuff for the party um okay here is an egg poacher this is another thing that i just like have been wanting for so long and it's a double egg poacher you do it in the microwave and i'm just like obsessed with poached eggs i love eggs benedict so if i could make that at home i feel like it would be amazing so i'm really freaking excited to try this thing out and then here is something that i feel like everyone already has but i got a salt lamp and this is the reason why this box is so heavy i feel like this would just be so calming i know that some people like use it in the bathroom um just to have like a calming shower or like a bath i kind of want to start taking baths more but they just like bore me so i don't know how i'm gonna start doing that <laughs> but maybe this will help and then i have butterfly clips um for my halloween costume i thought i could do the pink ones in my hair um because that's like kind of like y2k kind of goes along with the brats 
theme. This is really random, but we went to a really nice steakhouse at the beach and they had these um, automatic like pepper and salt. Um, what is it called? What the frick is it called? It's just an electric salt and pepper grinder and theirs had like a little light every time you like flipped it over and I thought it was literally the coolest thing in the world and you know pepper just like sometimes frustrates me because you have to like shake it like a million times to just get like this much out of it so I was like okay you know what we are finding this on Amazon and I found it I swear it was like 20 bucks and I was kind of shook because it's like really nice I mean it's super heavy um, but like it looks so nice so i'm very excited to add this to my kitchen these are cheesecloths and they're going to be used to kind of like drain my pulp when i'm juicing with my blender my vitamix doing it in my vitamix it definitely can be done and i think this will help but i kind of wanted to just look into getting a juicer again i feel like it'll just be a little bit more efficient i don't know if you guys know this but Pretty much you can find anything on Amazon and there's even like brand stores now. So for example, UGG has their brand store on there. So I wanted to get some new Uggs for the season. I got the mini ones in chestnut and they are so cute. I know these are already gonna be so comfy. I have three other pairs. I have these and like the long ones and then the black ones and the long ones. And I think I have like a knit one. I have no idea where that knit one is. I feel like it's at my mom's house. I remember every season she would just steal my Uggs because they were, you know, at her house during college. I went to school in Florida, so I didn't really need them there, but I wanted them there. <laughs> also, you guys know I am obsessed with my furry Birkenstock and I left them at home during the beach trip just because I didn't want them to get like sandy or too dirty at the beach. And I'm just so happy to be back and, you know, back with my furry Birks. This is definitely one of those products that TikTok made me buy. I got the green Bissell machine and I'm so freaking excited to use this because lord knows we need it um not only in my car but also on our carpet in our bedroom you know sophie sometimes is a bad girl and she has accidents when we're sleeping even though we put pee pads out i mean she's like a trained dog she pees outside she poops outside we take her out very often but you know sometimes these dogs just have a little freaking mind of their own even when the pee pads out they just pee right next to it on the carpet. In our last apartment, we actually rented a carpet cleaner from Home Depot like twice. I think Ryan said it was like $35 or something like that, maybe like 50, I don't know, for like an hour, two hours. But I was like, you know what? If this is like gonna be a consistent problem that we can't really like help because you know we take her out and stuff, we're already doing everything right, then we should invest in our own little carpet cleaner. I'm really excited to try it out. I think I'm gonna make a TikTok on it and I'm really hoping that it actually does what I've seen on TikTok because if it does, then this is definitely gonna be my new favorite cleaning tool. This next box is going to be kind of random. This is lavender syrup. I feel like I've had more matchas that I like that have lavender syrup in it than the ones that don't. So I was like, you know what? I should just try to make my own matcha at home and see if I can recreate it and save some money. I got more shoes. These are house slippers and they have these really cute smileys on them. I've seen these on Amazon for a while now and I was like, you don't need them, you don't need them. But then I was like, you want them though. They are so soft inside and literally so adorable. I feel like this would be a really good like stocking stuffer because I think it's pretty affordable, like probably in the $20 range. My battery is dying, so I had to change it, but we're back and I thought we would do the Abercrombie bag next. Okay, so starting with this one, I got this sweater vest and I love Abercrombie's quality. It is honestly so amazing, but also I feel like they raise their prices. Like I do not remember it being this expensive in high school, but I mean, I love their clothes and the quality is great. So I understand, but like it sucks. But this is a sweater vest. It's kind of like an oversized sweater vest and I'm not really sure how I'm going to style it just yet. But like I said, I'm just so excited to be back home with my fall clothes and like in this fall weather, it's just like so inspiring just to be in a new season. I saw these shorts on sale for like $23 or something crazy. So I snatched them up. These are the high rise mom short and I had these before I had like my gold day ones. I literally wore them all summer. Like they were the only shorts I would wear because they're just so comfortable. They're boxy. I love that they have the little slit like a gold day does. I don't know if you can see that um but yeah i thought i would just have a black pair for the fall i know austin can sometimes have you know hotter fall days i finally got the infamous jeans 
I feel like Abercrombie always has like a pair of jeans every season or every year at least that go TikTok viral. These are the 90s relaxed jeans. They're the high rise and I got them in a blue color because you guys know I don't have enough blue freaking mom jeans. I don't know why I do this to myself. I literally need to go get rid of like half my jeans because some of them just like don't fit me anymore. I don't even know. The slit looks perfect. I've seen so many TikToks on my For You page recently saying how amazing these jeans are. So I will keep you guys updated on my Instagram stories. If you guys are already following me over there, go ahead and do so. I'm obsessed with just like baggy sweatpants, sweatshirts. I got this sweatshirt recently on my beach trip and I am obsessed with just like the oversized fit of it. And so I wanted to get more sweats from Abercrombie because I have like a couple pairs that are just perfect. So these are, I want to say the Sunday something. I don't think it says, but anyways, I think they're the Sunday sweats. These are another pair of sweatpants, but these are a little bit different. These ones have a little flared leg at the end and I just love the color of these. They're the perfect heathered gray. Next up, we have a package from Gordiana. My whole bracelet stack is from them. I literally never take it off. I swim in the ocean. I always shower with them and they don't like leave me turning green or they don't rust. Their quality is truly unmatched and I know it is a little bit pricier, but especially something like this, if you're wearing it every single day, like you're gonna get your use out of it. We have some drop earrings. These are called um the brooks drop earrings and i thought they were so precious and i really want to start getting into just like wearing more statement pieces and switching out my hoops which are also from Gloriana, but like i literally never take them out next up is this beautiful little pendant necklace and this one is called um the power gemstone aura necklace for abundance okay let me show you up close i hope you guys can see this i know it's really sunny right now it really was not a good time to be filming but i need to start getting ready because i have a um party to go to tonight it's october 28th so like halloween weekend is starting today today's party is kind of like an 80s thrift prom and i didn't really have time to go thrifting so i literally bought like a poofy skirt on amazon and all of the stuff I bought on Amazon, I literally ordered yesterday, and it says it's coming by 10 p.m. tonight, and the party starts at 9. So we're praying, we're hoping that it gets here by like 8, so that I can leave at like 8.30 and meet my friends. Before I forgot, I wanted to show you guys these shoes that I got from Amazon. I'm planning on wearing them tonight because I feel like they are giving me very 80s vibe. Honestly, I'm really bad with my decades. They kind of just like combine in my head, but these are beautiful. These are pretty much a dupe of those shoes that like every blogger has now. I want to say they're called like mock mocks. No, mosh mo I don't even know. They have a clear base. They have a nude base. They have it all. So highly recommend checking this out. Unfortunately, these were not on prime. I think I waited about like two to three weeks, but like look how stunning these are. The sun is making me so hot. But we only have two more packages to open. This is for my birthday, actually. These are pink rose petals, and I was planning on putting them in the cocktails. I'm in love with just pretty drinks with the cutest garnishes, so I knew at my birthday party I had to have drinks like that. So I got some rose petals, and I'm going to have um, a bunch more cute garnishes, but I think I'm going to wait again till it gets closer to the event to get all those. I just wanted to make sure I ordered the stuff that said it wasn't prime um, as soon as possible. All right, the last package is some beauty stuff. I used to be obsessed with watching beauty tutorials and makeup tutorials and all of that stuff, but I kind of like phased out of it. Every once in a while, I will come across a makeup video that makes me feel so inspired, and I love that feeling. And there's this makeup artist named painted by Spencer. He's actually one of my older sorority sister's brothers and he is so freaking talented. Like the way he makes people's eyes like so big and beautiful. I just don't know how he does it. But anyways, he was talking about just like gel liner and I'm pretty sure in one of his videos he used um, this gel liner by Inglot. I remember hearing this brand when I was like in high school. So when I heard him talk about it again, I was like, I need it. I'm going to try it out finally. So I got one eyeliner in a brown color because I'm obsessed with like a brown wing. My favorite felt tip eyeliner is the one from Glossier. It's the pro tip eyeliner, but unfortunately it doesn't come in brown. I think it only comes in black. I also got just like an eyeliner brush, an angled brush, which was not from Inglot, just like some random company that I saw pop up when I was looking for these eyeliners and I was like, that's probably something I 
would need. So that is all the packages. Now I need to break down these boxes. You guys probably think I'm freaking nuts and have a shopping addiction, which like slightly, yes I do, especially on Amazon. If you guys are on the same wavelength as me and also have the Amazon addiction, definitely go check out my Amazon storefront. I have so much good stuff. I'm And soon I'm going to start creating my holiday gift guides on my blog and my Amazon storefront. So I'm gonna have like two separate gift guides. The ones on my blog are probably gonna be things that you may not be able to find at Amazon, but the ones on my Amazon storefront obviously hopefully will be prime. I feel like with this Halloween weekend, everything I ever wanted to buy could have been a costume. So nothing was prime. Nothing was coming before October 31st. I got very lucky with all of my brat stall accessories because if I would have ordered one day later, it definitely would not have come by Halloween. Oh.